everybody, this is Russell Holly with Geek.com, and we are going to take a quick wander through Google Inbox. Now what you're seeing here is basically an email client for Gmail that uh, has been made to take advantage of material design and add a whole bunch of new features that, that you know just kind of replace existing things. We've got pins, we've got reminders, uh, things that can be attached to normal emails. Uh, that, that you know really just add a little bit of functionality that are it's different from the way that we normally use things pins are a big deal they can be used uh, instead of stars where you can take things and pin them and then you can switch to uh, you know just a schedule you can you can take emails and snooze them dismiss them so that they're not in your inbox until a specific time a specific date or a specific place you can have your GPS launch emails in your inbox uh, or you can uh, you know, go through and filter them into uh, a whole bunch of different categories that are uh, just kind of uh, more detailed versions of the tabs. Uh, but if you need to create folders, folders are still a thing that exists. You can go and build whatever folder you want and then move those things into your folders. It's really just a different way of looking at Gmail. And that's kind of the important thing here is that, you know, instead of kind of ripping the Band-Aid off and forcing everyone into this new des uh, design decision, these are a whole bunch of new options that users can choose to use instead of the existing Gmail client, which for many people is still okay. Uh, you can create emails in very much the same way that you would right now. Uh, not a whole lot has changed there. This is really all about managing the inbox, and that is why it is called Google Inbox. The most useful thing that you're going to find here is if you are constantly looking through your inbox, never been a big fan of that inbox zero concept. These are just new tools that will help alongside that, especially the pinning. If you use emails on a day-to-day -day basis, being able to pin important emails and get to them quickly without having to kind of search. Search is still there. It's just not nearly as useful when you have some of these other tools. Keeping in touch with material design, you can switch back and forth. You can swipe one way or the other in order to either uh, quickly snooze emails or archive them. And if you get to the end of the day and you want to archive all the messages that are there, you can generate this sweep message, which is anything that's not pinned gets immediately swept away. Uh, you can still search for it, but it's not in your direct inbox. Uh, and you can break that down day by day and you know, really just kind of be more organized about your email if, if that's the kind of problem that you have. And ideally, you want to have you know the end of the day where there's nothing in that inbox. That seems to be a big part of what Google's going for with this setup. Existing users should get invites on Friday. Thanks for watching.